All right, y'all. Taylor Swift came out with a new music video, so we're about to check that out. I hear people all the time tell me, you listen to Taylor Swift? Yes, I listen to Taylor Swift. Her music is happy, usually. I mean, the message sometimes might be a little sad, but for the most part, her music is happy. It brings people together. It is decent music, y'all. I mean, it is decent music. For, for those out there who don't listen to Taylor, it, Taylor's music is decent. It's got good music. It's got good rhythm. It's nothing. It's not bad. It's good music. I, I wouldn't say I'm the hugest Taylor Swift fan in the world. I mean, there's some people that are, you know, way beyond me. But I, like I said, I enjoy a good Taylor Swift song, y'all. I'm not going to lie. I do. I went, I'm going to her concert in October. So we're just over, what, two months away down in Miami checking this out gonna be lots of fun hopefully i see some people there who rec- might recognize me from here uh, so we're about to check his song out the song is called i can do it with a broken heart let's check it out let's check it out let's get right to it i like i think i've heard that song before i, I know i've never seen the video i think the video just came out yesterday didn't it what yeah one day ago yeah i hadn't heard the I haven't seen the video. I've heard the song before. I haven't seen the video. I like, the, you know what? I love videos like this. I do. Because let me tell you something. This right here, these kind of videos right here, put life to the person. Whereas, you know, you, you go to a concert, you see the stage show. You see them on TV, you see the stage show. <laughs> but when you see videos of like behind the scenes stuff, it, you, you see the person. You see the real life person. And you can tell from the video that I just watched that she will treat all of her, she treats everybody the same. There's nobody, you know, you could tell she is thankful for every single fan that she gets and she appreciates everybody. And you don't see her, you don't hear her talk bad about people. Uh, and, you know, and, and let's be honest in today's political climate, and this goes for both ways. Don't think it's not just one way. This is both ways. If you aren't with that certain clique of that group, whether which side of it is, you're 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 not allowed to cross over to have ideas on either side. And if you do, you're usually shunned by that group. You're it's like you're like a traitor. Where she lets people just everybody come in. She's like, come on in, everybody, come on. Just, let's just have a. She's like, let's just have a good time, and just listen to music and enjoy life. And that's what she, and at least that's how I take it. The way I see, like in her videos and the way she does carries herself, uh, and and that's what I like about. It. I like what I like about Taylor. And I I was so wrong about her when I you know if I, I listen to all the stereotypes from her. I mean, I'll be honest when I first before I start listening to her about what people would say about her, and none of it's true. And all these people who they say I can't stand, I, I hear, I hear it so much. I don't, I probably don't know maybe one or two people that actually listen to her music. At least admit they must listen to her music. I mean, I'll admit to, I like her music, uh, but everybody who I've ever heard saying they can't stand her, I'd be like, well, what, what songs of hers have you listened to that you didn't like? And they just look at you. Well, I've never heard any of her songs, and I don't need to hear any of her songs. What do you mean you don't need to hear any of her songs? I, you can't make a judgment up based on somebody's just their type of music or, you know, something, you know, there's type of music or how they sing. I mean, if I did that, I would only listen to one singer. I mean, yeah, pretty much listen to one singer. And if y'all know me, and if y'all have been following this channel, if you go back through my history of music, my, my main music is heavy metal. I love heavy metal. I love heavy metal. That is my go-to, but I listen to everything. I listen to rap. I listen to classical. I love classic rock. So like your Elvis Presley, your Righteous Brothers. I listen to, you know, uh, more hard rock like Disturbed. I love rap. Like I like Cardi B. I like Megan Thee Stallion. I listen to Sexy Red. I listen to everything. And if you don't open yourself up to different styles, different types of music, you're just a closed-minded person. And that's not who I am. So I do catch a lot of crap because I like Taylor Swift's music. I, some of her songs are amazing. I like this. This is a good song. I'm going to say it's my favorite song of hers. I won't say it's my favorite, but I, this was a good, I like this song. I really did like this song. It was a good song to listen to. Um, but her music, I, that's why I say I cannot wait to go to see her in concert in October. Uh, just so I can see what, it's, what, she, what the energy is like. Like, I think my last concert I went to was, a, I went and saw Pantera and Lamb of God 
and then I'm going to see corn and Gojira. Uh, I got Limp Biscuit coming up, and then and then I got Sexy Red concert coming up in September, followed by Nicki Minaj next week, and then I got Taylor Swift coming up in like a month, two months, what, two months, month and a half, month and a half down in Miami. So I listen to a lot of music. I like music, so that's just me. I like music. I'm, I guess I'm odd. Uh, I'm an oddball, kind of a nerd too. Yeah, I'm actually a big nerd. Anyways, sorry y'all. Anyways, please subscribe to this channel. I'm trying to grow this channel huge. Um, I think we're about to cross over to 10,000. My next goal is going to be 5,000. I want to try to get to 15,000 by Christmas time. So right around the end of the year. So we'll see where we go from here. Uh, I'm just thankful for every person that follows me on here. Follow me on Instagram too. I talk to people. For those, if you put in, if you talk to people who are on my Instagram too, who follow me on Instagram, who come off of my YouTube channel, I talk to everybody. If you don't send me a message, I'm going to talk to you. Unless you're leaving some hate mail or some something nasty. Actually, I might respond to that too. Uh, might not like what you hear back, but I'll respond to it. Anyways, anyways, I'll see y'all on the next video, y'all. Keep rolling.